Go ahead, Dave. No, I don't know who makes that stuff. Who did it? Authentic this? Airlines, is it a guy out of Germany. He did the conversion for the 747-8F cargo, but now Ravel's got the cargo lux one. It's probably a lot better. Uh, it's not bad. It's, it's spendy with the Euro conversion. And then I got the two decal sets for the whatever they, when they won the playoffs they made did that that's uh mm -hmm. basically boeing's got their demo livery uh cargo aircraft and they big deal they painted it after the playoffs and it's kind of a hot deal and i'll let you know that after the, they won the super bowl and up here dickies gave you free sandwiches down in Denver, they didn't. No, Darn. I don't know why. <laughs> <Can't understand. Man. laughs> Terrible. Terrible. They were kind of, they were really kind of butthurt. Yeah. Uh, Marty the Martian. Yeah, Marvin the Martian from uh, the guy was he retro. He's got uh, odds and ends of things. So one of the things he also does is the minions. But every little minion, every time the movie has another minion, he puts out another minion. You know. Oh, and then more projects. This will sit on my shelf for another 20 years. Just Alex, like everything oh, you else. Mean Alex gets in here with uh, you? I ain't getting into that. Especially with those tracks. That's a no. Yeah. Well, actually, I don't know what they can do. Two piece tracks. Yeah. Wow. And everybody complains about them. The detail's not bad. It's just that they're just they're super stiff. Real heavy tracks. They look good when you get them on. It's just yeah. you got to let your. So you know, being, being thought I'd be slick, I got the Fruley tracks. Well, so in the like, back. <laughs> I looked at them and went, oh my god. Dude, I'm just starting some Panzer IV ones um, today. Well, the thing is, the joy is for these, the pins, 2.5 millimeters. A bazillion of them. They find out that my chopper's good for that. You get you get yeah. a rhythm going, you can put those together pretty well. It's just, yeah, right. the only thing is just the pins are so there. short. Well, the worst part is, I don't care what they tell you. And then you Will lied to me, because he told me he had an LVPT-7 a1, but no, it was an AA. So he lied to me. You still get used that. to that. Same thing. I know. <laughs> Wait, that, you get that from Will me? told me, oh, everybody <laughs> makes one of those Australian M1 conversions. <laughs> one <laughs> epic company does. Yeah. One. So that's, this is another, I found a picture. Uh, I guess they did a. I think it's supposed to be. For the Navy had, we were doing like research on a low velocity to 105. So they mounted that in a shirt and turret, stuck it on top of an L LTVP set. Hull. So, you, so you're gonna take the turret. You're gonna take the turret off of this one and put it on that one. Yeah, five millimeter M68 A1 barrel. Battery can use a lot for the first My Israeli 60 millimeter. I think that honestly, I think all those barrels like the storage. It's the GD link. I don't do it though. So they stuck in MGSs and they went. You know what? Or was it? We'll leave make any for you. Or do you I can't see it. It was. Um, oh, yes, you can. So, again, more projects can sit on the shelf for us. Oh, Dave's officially on our shelf room for a long time. Yeah. Oh, is that? Oh, is that your. Oh, that's right. Like the rest of us? I don't know. It was like a job. I got more than the shelf. It's supposed to be a destroyer. It's the biggest gun. They have a five inch gun. They were tagged like Japanese battleships. And that's the twin guns. The mama gave me the saw the box that I brought home. I got the squadron that. It's like you. It's like you. Tony, uh, 